Hey guys, Aptag 101 here, and today I'm bringing you a review of the OtterBox Commuter Series case for the iPod Touch 4G. I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but um, it rates a 3 out of 4 on the OtterBox rugged level here. And uh, so it'll keep your case nice and protected, you don't have to worry about that. Uh, the case came with several things. First of all, a screen protector, which is really nice, but um, I completely failed putting that on, so my iPod doesn't have it. Also, a uh, screen cloth wiper uh, to keep your get your screen nice and clean before you put the screen protector on, and this uh, really neat OtterBox uh, squeegee card. It's got a it's got their company picture thing, the the Otter on there and also a sticker with their company logo we've got technology covered so yeah let's get straight to putting on the case so I'll just get this out of the way um, first thing I want to mention is this is a two-piece case one part being a soft kind of stretchy silicone skin it protects us it protects your iPod against scratches and all that so and also you don't have to be worried about it getting scratched in the case uh, um, while some other cases uh, like I had before would scratch my device while they're in the case so they're yeah this one's really nice <coughs> so the first thing you want to do is take this and slide the iPod in uh, bottom first and into the bottom of the case and just kind of stretch the top over like that and just make sure everything's aligned right and these little flaps you want to put in their holes there we go so it should look like this and then next what you do is you take this hard case and once again slide the bottom straight in like this until it hits the end and the top you just kind of have to push over like that it's kind of doesn't really snap in but it just kind of goes on and then if it's a little uneven all you have to do is just kind of massage it and it should align right eventually <clears throat> so let's go over a few of the features of the case itself um, right over here we've got the camera cutout and the light sensor cut out <clears throat> the whole screen none of the screen is covered so you've got your few uh, full viewing capability <clears throat> the there's a little engraving here for the home button and I don't know if you can hear it but it's still easily pressable um, what else um, here on the bottom <laughs> What I really like about this case is there's these flaps. They kind of <coughs> cover the dock connector and the headphone jack. They basically what they do is to they keep the dust out of there, which is really nice. You have to clean it much less often. And also we have the a speaker cutout. There's no flap for that because it's just really tiny, so you don't need to worry about that the these flaps the dock connector one is pretty easy to get in and out but the nine millimeter jack head uh, flap is it kinda takes some getting used to putting it back in but after that it's really easy um the volume rockers they're really easy to push uh, they've got little uh, raised areas here as you can see they're really easy to push and um, also the sleep wake button it takes some getting used to you have to push it a little bit harder than usual but it is pretty functional now let's move over let's move over to the back uh, we've got this OtterBox company logo here uh, and this Apple logo cut out I mean that's what made me buy the case in addition to all the other cool features uh, I don't know something about other cases they cover the Apple logo and they kind of remove the devices like Apple-ness 
I don't know how to describe it exactly. But I really like this. And also the camera cut out. In a second, let me bring it a little bit closer. I don't know if you can see, but it's a really good cutout. It's right on the dot. Let me switch back to here we go. And um yeah, that's pretty much it for the case. There's this really cool design on the back. Uh, it's kind of red on the back with some black spots. And I, I got red and black because it's kind of a modern or modern looking. It comes in several different colors. The case comes in uh, several different colors. Uh, the ones I can remember off the top of my head are black and white. Uh, the hard part being black and this silicone skin being white. You can also get uh, blue and white, the hard part being blue, and this being white. And the reason I, I was going to get that, uh, but I, the reason I didn't was, I don't know, it's, I've had a feeling it might be a little bit too light blue, and I don't know, I just didn't want that. So I got this red and black, and it, it's, a, it's a really good overall case. I've been using it for a couple weeks, and it's been, my iPod has been following really hard like I dropped it off the top, top of my bunk bed and down the stairs and whatnot and nothing happened to it at all alright guys uh, this has been a review by Aptec 101 thanks for watching uh, one one more thing I want to uh, I don't know if you can see this but uh, Mr. Crazy uh, 1870 uh, is his username he is the reason I got this case. He did a great review of it also. I uh, think you should watch it just in case you didn't get something from my review. Um, I'll post a link down in the description. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for the thanks for watching this. Uh, please like and subscribe. It really helps me out. See you guys.